Hi, my name is John Michaels, and I work for Intuit in the Plano office in Texas. Today I want to walk you through the installation of the Fujitsu FI-6130Z scanner. Before plugging in the scanner, you must first run the Fujitsu installation CD. It should look like this. If you plug the scanner in prior to running the installation, the drivers will not install properly and you may have to uninstall and then start over again. So make sure to install the CD before plugging in the scanner. So we'll put this in the DVD drive or CD-ROM drive. If it doesn't auto run, then you must go to computer, look for the CD-ROM drive or DVD drive, and double click it. The file you're looking for will be autoplayer.exe. You want to double click on that, and this will bring you to the setup screen. All right, you want to click on Install Recommended. This next screen, screen is the Fujitsu product registration. You can fill out all this information for the product registration. Here I'm going to hit cancel. Remind me in 14 days. We're going to choose language English next. And the top one, 6130Z, next. At the licensing agreement screen, you want to click yes, I accept the terms of the license agreement, and then hit next. Choose destination location. Here, destination is C program files FI scanner. You can choose to browse for another location, but the default should be OK. Hit next. This screen shows you all the different drivers that are being installed. Next. Okay, once it's complete, you want to say yes, I want to restart my computer now. In my case, I'm going to say no, because I already installed it, and hit finish. And then want to exit the setup. Here we want to plug the scanner in, and it's the basic USB cable. And we'll plug it straight into the uh, USB port. Okay. 
and the system should see it. We can verify this if we go to start devices and printers and you should see your scanner at the top. Here it is. So that you know Windows sees the scanner and it's installed properly. So once we boot it back up, we should be right at the screen. All right, the next step, let's uh, scan some source documents. We want to go to the Scan All Pro shortcut, which is under your Start menu, or All Programs under Jitsu Scan All Pro. We'll double click on that. Okay. Let's first go into scan settings. Here's where you can save the file to a folder name. It defaults to the users, um, whatever username documents, and you can browse to change it to any drive. You can use the use the name rule. It'll automatically put a file name in there for you. Or you can uncheck it and then put in whatever name you want to call it. The file format, typically it's going to be PDF. But you have the option to change it to whatever format you want to save it to. The rest of the settings are pretty straightforward. The next step we want to go into scanner settings. And this is where you can change the DPI, the image mode, the scan type. Most Intuit products, we like to see resolution at 300 by 300, or you can change it to whatever, higher or lower. And black and white is uh, another standard that uh, Intuit products use, but you can always change it to grayscale or color for any other purpose. And the scan type, you'd want to use the ADF front side, or you can change the duplex or any other option here. The rest of the settings, you can adjust or you can read the Fujitsu manual to get more in-depth information about it, about these settings. Say OK, and then OK again. Now let's do a test. You can hit this button for scan, or hit scan at the top here menu. So let's hit scan. Continue uh, scanning. Do you want to continue scanning? Say no. And there they are. Exit here. Go to my documents. And there it is. And that concludes the walkthrough of the FI6130Z installation. Thank you.